Hello everybody, Shafa Sky is here and the new Sky Children with the Light update, patch update precisely 0.15.5 has arrived and in today's video I'm just going to show you some minor details, uh, more minor updates that people might have, haven't noticed. Okay, so we're gonna start from the first update. So what I meant by minimizing your app is when you open your control center in case you're in an iOS device like me or accidentally opening a notification that appears above your screen or just minimizes your app with your home button and your SkyKit will stay in the same position. They won't sit like what it used to be. It works when you're in the land, not in the mid air. So uh, it, just, uh, it just changes when you, you're trying to minimize the app and then your SkyKit will not sit down as what it used to be. It will keep staying the same position. If, for example, if you playing an emote or you stand, it won't sit down as what it used to be. Well, you can try it yourself. If you still don't understand what I mean, please correct me if I'm wrong. If my, also if my explanation is just unclear, but everything is by experience. You'll know. You'll understand later. Now let's just keep moving to the next update. Enable flight mode changes at the constellation gate entrance to the wind paths. Yes, I need this update. It was a disaster. And there you can see, in the rightmost side, the toggle button is there. Next, we have audio and visual polish. I literally have no idea which one is the visual polish, but we'll go on with the audio one. I'll stop talking right now. Ridiculously, TGC has added another candle cluster since the previous beta build. 
yeah, it's ridiculous, I know. It's just on top of the island near the Prophecy Cave, Twin Pats, whereas we know um, the other small cluster on these random floating islands is just the small island below the Hermit Valley Wind Pats. Hmm. Whatever, not a big update anyway. Let's move. So, this is me opening beta. I just noticed these rocks actually floats. Is that new? I don't know. Leave home and return your journey in hidden forest. So, beside from the return shrine color, it, the text also indicates which realm you have visited previously. So, I think that's a good indicator for players. I once grabbed my office cape to enter the office because, surprisingly, the text says that leave home and resume your journey to the light. In a way, it makes sense because office, Nintendo Switch area, are those forbidden places that people can't enter easily. But the real light, aka Orbit, I don't think it has the name of the light, but I have eaten instead. Humanoid masks have the same ability with chibi masks now, so they blink and if they do certain poses or stances, uh, they can close their eyes, just like chibi masks, but that doesn't work on animal-like masks like weasel mask and bird mask. I don't have complete masks in my closet. But at least you know that only her magnetic mask blink now. At least they have the same ability as Chibi. Whereas the Chibi mask itself, we can read uh, the text below here. I'd say it's a technical difficulty to fix the beta back recently. It just makes the eye bigger. I'm currently in the late back pioneers fireplace. Uh, there is a candle here. You can sit down on these logs, the stones, I don't know, uh, just in the edges of the fireplace. There are four seats in total. Talking about fireplace, so there is an attempt of me and my friend Bintang um, to find a fireplace inside the valley maze, but I just realized and the previous beta build was deleted, so I apologize for this. I think useless information, but to let you know, it was one of the season of belonging beta updates, but it doesn't come to belonging in the live version. So we'll just leave it as a memory because it blocks the way out of the valley maze. Still continuing on with the uh, new patch update, so. I and Bindang proceeded to go to the Prairie Cave New Idol Wax location. So I think all of you already know that there are uh, four new uh, socialite places or and three of them are idol waxes so you can well AFK there for not almost 10 minutes and there were some environment polishing since this idol wax place is added. You can see the flowers are now white and yellow combination. And the, I don't know, the hall here is looking more natural, more bended with the nature. So many grasses, not with stones anymore. And you can see it's all the prairie cave idol wax place is a lot more mysterious and natural. Yay! Thumbs up for TGC. This is a minor detail that people might not actually know, but it says that TGC has deleted the clouds to cover areas inside the prophecy cave and surprisingly it was a bug i thought it was intended 
and I have a small pic over here um, before the clouds were deleted. I would say this is the last minor detail or update I have noticed. So it was not something important, but it was so long time ago that the uh, section that the part of the constellation table that recharges your sky kit is the right edge of it and i just realized i chibi it fall i chibi fold a few days ago and i saw it was a candle under it but still i'm not certain if it's actually a candle hanging over there in the previous versions but since this update it disappeared again and Instead, there is a flame, a very, you know, intense flame if it hasn't served much and there is a lit button over it and then when you tap on that button, the flame will light up above the constellation table. I saw it in the beta previously and it came to live too, so I think it's just interesting to have something unique in the home space. Um, before that, I also knew that the new constellation UI is hyped and a lot of people were looking into it. But unfortunately, and as I predicted, it hasn't come to live because one of the TGC members, the TGC staffs, said, Sagume said that... Um, Thank you so much to everyone who has taken the time to send in feedback for this first version of the Friend Constellation revamp. Your comments and input have been incredibly helpful as our team has been head down working on the next version. Next version, they say, to share in one of our next beta updates. So it's currently still in the beta testing phase. For now, since we're focusing on the next version of the constellation for a future update, it is not necessary to send further feedback on this first version of the friendship constellation. So until this point, there were no beta updates I saw. So we're just going to wait. And what I heard from the previous beta updates announcements, this constellation UI update will be in a very long testing time. Well, we definitely value your feedback, we also want to be respectful, respectful of your time. We're working on an update that includes some of the improvements and suggestions that folks have already sent. And once we're able to share that in a beta update, we'll be all ears. Well, eyes, when you send in your next round of feedback in beta feedback. Thank you, as always. Alrighty, people, I have to end the video here. Honestly, I'm exhausted to make a compilation of this bunch of videos. But anyways, by that, I hope this video complements the other guides and you can find this video useful. I will link some useful links below and maybe an Indonesian subtitle to my Indonesian watches. Thank you so much for watching. It means to me a lot. Goodbye and see you in my other sky adventures. Dadah semua dan sampai jumpa kembali.